Oh shit, long ass hallway. Oh. What is up YouTube and welcome back to another video. It's another Ichio indie horror game. It's actually a pretty new one. It's called Deja Vu. I didn't see any videos on it, so I might be the first video, but who knows. Not really sure what it's about at all, but it looked kind of nice, and I knew it was brand new, so let's get right into it. Oh, so we got a little cutscene in the beginning, okay. A little creepy-ass flickering light and shit, damn, yeah, the candles always freak me out in horror games. Especially if they only give you a candle to light the way. Are we supposed to pick this up? No. Okay. Cue to lean. I guess it's click to open up the door. Shit, this game actually looks pretty good so far. I think he said on the Itch.io page it's his first horror game, so... Oh shit. You're a radio in here. Oh damn, this is the title screen. Yeah, this whole house looks creepy as shit. Can I turn this off? Let me see if I can go in this room right here. Okay, I think I can. Do I have a flashlight? Kinda wish I had one. Oh, what the fuck is this? It's a doll. I think there's a door right here too, yep. A little side little kitchen or something. Yeah, the refrigerator looks fucked up though. Dude was a drinker, he's got a whiskey flask right there. Yeah, I can't open up that at all. I can open up this little door right here, though. It's like a back room, what the fuck? Oh, I got an axe, can I pick up the axe? No, it doesn't look like I can pick up anything. Got a shit ton of shotguns and tools and shit, too. Oh, what the fuck? We went down this hallway earlier. I'm gonna head out here, cause that's just creeping me out. Can we head out the house? There's gotta be a way out of here. Can I pick up one of these things? Nope. Got a broken camera. That swinging light's freaking me out, too. It's probably a ghost pushing it, or else it would have stopped by now. Alright, so no, we can't head out the house. Well, I guess let's go back to that staircase, because that's the last place we really have to go. Is this like a PT-style game, where it's just gonna repeat the house over and over again, but it gets creepier each time? The fuck? It's kind of what it's sounding like. Yep, it's a PT-style game. It's one of these creepy-ass games, so it's gonna be something different. Yep, I can't open up that door. Is the house changed at all? It's a lot darker. Can't open up that door either. Where the fuck am I supposed to go then? Oh! Oh shit, the TV turned on. Fuck that. Little ass dumbass jump scare. I'm not gonna lie, this game is building up the atmosphere really well though. Can I actually go outside this time? No, it doesn't even look like anything's out there. So now that that TV turned on, did something else trigger or something? Oh! Yep, this door opened. It's gonna be a jump scare, aren't there? Oh! The door closed! Someone's knocking. Yeah, this usually happens in these PT style games, like I get knocking or something! Oh, now that door is open. Let's just get the fuck out of here. I don't even know if there's a monster or there's jump scares, but this shit's creepy already. Let's get the fuck out of here. Can we pick up this axe? Like, bro, we literally have an axe, a, like a shotgun, all this shit, but we don't decide to pick it up each time. Guess let's head to the next fucking house, see how much more creepier it can get. See what else fucking horrors we gotta go through. Probably the radio's gonna turn on or something. Yep, that's locked again. Oh, that can open up! To the kitchen right away. Oh! <gasps> no! What the fuck? How'd I just transport into here? All that creepy ass whispering and shit. I swear to god, there's like a fucking creepy ass little ghost girl or something. Can we head through this door again? Yep. Hopefully it doesn't fucking burn out on us. Let's go to the next fucking house. I think that was the only scare for this one. Shit, I don't know. The game said it should take about 15 minutes, so shit. Oh, there's different paintings here. I don't know what the fuck this is. Let's just go to the- Oh, what the- This is different! There's a body here now. We're going into the house from, like, the backwards side. What the fuck? Why is there a body, though? Oh! I- I saw something! Oh, it's the fucking body hanging. Holy shit. This game's fucking with me now. Now it's just a whole bunch of the same games. I said games, I meant rooms. The fuck? We're about to get jumped. Oh, shit. What is this? He has come to collect a skull. Oh, shit. Long ass hallway. Oh, what is that? Is he gonna come closer? He's probably gonna fucking jump scare our ass. Yep. Damn, that was the whole game. Well, shit, for, if that was really his first game, that was actually a really good game. I mean, it looked really good. It played well. I'd say that it should be a little bit more work on the scares. They weren't too scary, but they did get me freaked out, I can tell you that. 
This was a really good game. I thought that was pretty good. Maybe if they added more to it or something, put a little bit more levels in there, that'd be nice. But that was Deja Vu. It was actually a lot shorter than I expected. They said about 15 minutes, but it didn't take that long for me. It was a pretty good game, though. I'd say it was like an average PT-style game, which isn't bad at all. I mean, I know a lot of people don't like the PT-style games, but shit, I like almost all of them. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. I post daily, or at least I try to. Check out my live streams, too. It's been getting crazy over there. But I guess other than that, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.